Well, hello, and I'm glad you tripped and came on in to my Patreon channel. This channel that I'm doing, I want to teach two things. I want to teach tenor banjo in styles that aren't usually played on tenor banjo or haven't been played on tenor banjo in decades. And also, we are. I am going to show you to, how to play ukulele tuned in fifths. And on a soprano, that tuning would be G, D, A, E. And you would need a special set of strings for your ukulele to be able to go into that tuning. But I'll get more into that later. But mainly we're going to focus on ukulele and fifths, as I just said. And we're going to go into tenor banjo. And why tenor banjo? Well, as I'm setting this down, where it won't fall off, I'm personally kind of concerned that tenor banjo may become a lost art because I don't really see many people playing them. Now, most people, when they think of tenor banjo, they think of ragtime and they think of Dixieland jazz, swing jazz, jazz, that sort of thing. And there's nothing wrong with that. Those are neat styles and very enjoyable to listen to. But I got a clue that my first clue that tenor banjo was played in other styles um, came through my photo collecting. I collect very vintage photographs of musicians on various folk instruments. And some years back, I saw one up for bid, and what fascinated me was it was a cowgirl with a tenor banjo. And I thought, well, that's funny, because I play five-string banjo. I would have expected five-string banjo, but no, she had a tenor banjo. So I bought the photo and I thought, what is this all about? Anyway, my research led me to Western Swing. And uh, one photo, then I found a couple other photos of uh, cowgirls and cowboys with tenor banjos. And then it dawned on me that I'm willing to bet, and I don't really have any proof to back this up, but I am willing to bet that Probably back when in the when hillbilly music, you know, blue pre bluegrass and bluegrass was just getting started, probably the twenties and the thirties. Well, you probably would have had ten or tenor banjo players that you know back then you just couldn't say, "Oh, I need, I have a you know a, a, a four string banjo, but I now I got to go buy a five. People didn't have money to do that overall for the most part, so you played what you had. And if you had a tenor banjo, well, there's no reason in the world why you can't play bluegrass or uh, blues. I have a blues songbook that I got online, and much to my surprise, it showed guitar and tenor banjo chords for every blues song. And I thought, oh, oh, wow, so blues was played on tenor banjo as well. So that's what we're going to be exploring on this channel. I'm going to be presenting lessons and uh, presenting playing tips and so on for beginners. So if you have a, if some relative has a tenor banjo lying around that they don't want or they don't mind you borrowing and playing, or a ukulele that, you know, they don't mind you playing, go dig that tenor banjo or ukulele out of the closet because we're going to go have fun with it. So I hope you become a patron of this channel because that helps me be able to present more lessons to you. And uh, also it will ensure you don't miss out on any really cool stuff. So with that, I'm looking forward to seeing you later. Bye-bye.